Hey guys, it's Shannon, and this is another video in my Color on Color series. So today I'm doing purple. Um, I'm sorry, I have something on my lash. Alright, so we're going to start with the eyes. So I'm going to be using this. It's still there. I can see it when I look a certain way. Whatever. I'm using this Jean Paris palette, I think is how you pronounce it. Um, and these are the main shades I'm going to be using this whole purple row because it also has a, another row which is nudes. Which I've used this color before and I'm absolutely obsessed. And I'm just going to be doing my eyes and my lips. I'm not doing a full face because I have to do my makeup in a minute for work. And I don't want to take it all off just to, because I'm filming it also. So yeah. So I think, oh my gosh, what the heck? This is what I get for swimming in makeup yesterday. My makeup's all crusty and gross now. But yeah. Anyways, let's get started. So I'm going to start by taking this little blending brush, which is actually really precise with blending, as you can see. And I just washed it, so it's clean for once. And I'm actually going to go into the nudes part of it first and take this shade right here, which is kind of a purpley shade when you really look at it, which you can't really see it on camera. But I'm going to actually use it in my crease as a transition color. Just a little bit of it, not all of it. Like, a lot of it. It's kind of like a brown with a hint of purple in it, if that makes sense. But just because I'm using purple, I want a, like, a lot of dark purples. I really want a good transition shade, so it blends really nicely. just like that and then I think I'm going to start on my lid um, I have all my brushes beside me I'm gonna take this little flat brush I think it's from elf but don't quote me on that and I'm going to take this pinkish purple shade right here it's a really light lavender and I'm going to start by putting it all over my lid Like so. And then I'm actually going to take this kind of sparkly purple right here. And start putting it on the outer half of my eye and a little into my crease. Like that. And then I'll take the same blending brush and just blend it. like so and then again blending it on the other eye like that and then that's it for my actual lid itself um, in the crease I'm going to take this color right here on the very end which looks almost black and I'm not going to put it exactly in the crease but I'm going to put it on the outer corner just to darken it up and a little bit into the outer crease but not completely like that just to really darken it up. And 
And these darker shadows do have fallout, so you want to be careful with that if you do your foundation first. And then I'm actually going to take what's left on my brush and blend my under eye. Just like that. And that's it for shadows. Now, I had a liner I wanted to use. I just have to find it. I was going to use this one. It's a purple. Not for liner, for shadow. I forgot though. Okay. Let me see if I can find a clean eyeliner brush first. Oh, I found it! I had a bath fizzy. So I used it the other day, and I couldn't find it for the life of me. Why is it in my makeup bag? That I shall never know. I probably shoved it in there on accident. I need chapstick as well. Mm, nice. Alright, so I guess I'll just use my regular liner brush. I got black in it, whatever. This is the Maybelline New York Eye Studio, and it is in the color Sapphire. And it's a really pretty kind of royal purple. And I'm just going to take this on an angled eyeliner brush. And I just did a really nice wing. Sorry, my nose is itchy. Ow. When I was swimming yesterday, well, two days ago for you guys, I got really bad sunburn. It is all over my sh shoulders and stuff. And it's actually really surprising because it was really overcast yesterday. Well, yesterday for me. Um, So I was really shocked I got burnt as bad as I did. That wing's horrible. Oh, well, I'm taking this off in five minutes, so. Alright. So then I'll just put a little bit on my waterline. And actually, in person, this looks so close to black you wouldn't even know if it if you wore it every day like anyone else wouldn't notice they would just think you're wearing black liner unless you get like really up close and then it's still pretty much just so then we're gonna go crazy guys let me find it hold on didn't bring it. I don't think. Are you serious? Did I not bring it? I'm really sad. This was the whole reason I was doing this tutorial. It's because of this one liner. And now I don't have it. That makes me really upset. Whatever. Anyways. For mascara, I'm not using regular mascara. This is from Hard Candy, and it's a Lash Tinsel Glitter Mascara. And it is in the color Starstruck. And it looks like this. It's purple glitter. And then I had a purple liner that was glittery that was going to go with it. I was going to put it over top of my liner. This is really wet. That's what he said. Um, anyways, ignoring the end of windows.
which you can just pile on as much glitter as you want. But there we go. And then for lips, I'm doing this True Lips Lip Liner. It doesn't have a color. It's in the color 055. And it looks like this. We're going to line our lips. Which I'm just going to line them. I'm not going to fill them. And then I'm using this Danamere lipstick. And it is in the color 04. And it looks like this. Yes, I know it looks black, but it's not. I swear. Um, pardon me. I just belched. I'm sorry. Ow. Stop hurting. Hey, wow. It's turning into a tan. You know what? A side note. This stuff is amazing. It's called Lanocaine. And it's antibacterial first aid spray. I put it on my sunburn yesterday. I woke up this morning. I still have a sunburn, but it looks tan. It's amazing. I usually use... Oh, what's it called? I use a different one, which I really like. I like it better than that, but they were sold out, so I had to get that. This mascara is kind of sticky, I'm going to be honest. Anyways, this is the finished look. If I were to do foundation and stuff. <laughs> but yeah. So this is the makeup look itself. The purple on purple. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I upload every single day. Also, don't forget to comment any other colors or any other kind of videos you guys would like to see. There you can put those in the comments below, and I'll definitely do them for you guys. And if you want a shout-out, you can leave it down there as well. Um, if you suggest it, I will shout you out unless you don't want a shout-out. Then you can put kind of like a little thing. Or when I decide to do it. Um, like if you comment something that you want done. If you kind of private message me, whether it's on my Instagram or Pinterest or whatever... Uh, you can just tell me, hey, I want you to do this video, but can you not give me a shout out? Then that's fine as well. Um, but yeah, I think that's it for today. All my links are below for my social media, if you want to follow me on any of that. And I think that's it. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!